Shit's about to get weird. fuck is up gamers it's captain eon back with a uh, a weird game most of you have probably never seen this game before and uh that's probably for the best to be honest uh this game is oh, oh, probably early 2000s pc game for probably windows xp i used to play it as a wee lad it was a, a very integral part of my childhood i played it all the time and and honestly still kind of still kind of in it the other night i played in uh, free mode for a while and made a very successful park i've only played this game in free mode so today I'm actually going to do the campaign for the first time. And I figured, why not just record it for everyone's viewing pleasure? Because it should be funny. It's kind of awkward because this uh, game does, in fact, only use the arrow keys. And uh, will not use WASD. But uh, anyway, that's enough complaining. Let's do the campaign, shall we? Oh, let's see. We get a little thing to read first. Recent... Paleontological Paleontological excavations have uncovered particularly well-preserved specimens of prehistoric organisms. This amazing discovery has enabled the scientific world to progress greatly in the study of planet Earth, as it must have looked approximately 150 million years ago, and to improve mankind's understanding of the fauna of that era. But modern researchers have gone a bit further than that. Cut off- oh. Cut off from the rest of the world in their top secret laboratories, they have employed revolutionary new technologies to con reconstruct the DNA of the species who ruled the planet in the distant past. The dinosaurs. One of the world's most qualified experts in the field of genetics, you have been recruited by Professor Char Charles Mantell. The paleontological- please stop including this word, I can't- I can't say it. Paleontological. <laughs> paleontological supervisor of the gu- of the experiments to take charge of the government- of a government project- oh my goodness. Named duplication of incubated organisms of in extinct species. In short, Project Dinos. Uh, your mission, to bring back to life these legendary creatures that have fascinated him humankind for more than a century. They haven't fascinated us longer than that? Interesting. Whoa! The resolution of this game is just shocking. In my fight to regain control of my computer, because this game just takes over since it is, a. Uh, Old. Welcome, welcome, Professor. Welcome to the Caribbean. What a pleasure it is to have you joining us. An expert of your renown. Such a brilliant mind. 
And so young! Oh, thank you. I know. I don't think I've been this excited since my very first discovery back in 1964! That's my favorite number! Mm -hmm. The complete skeleton of an ar ar Archaeopteryx. You know, a wonderful, wonderful find. Here I am, chatting away, and I haven't even introduced myself yet. I am Charles Mantel. It is my honor to direct the research complex on this island. Admittedly, all we have at the present is a single laboratory. But with your help, it will soon be blooming, will it not? But first things first, allow me to show you around our island. You will soon find that apart from the occasional volcanic eruption, we will have our own little paradise here. I suggest you adjust your height. You will have a much better view of the island from above. What are we? Adjust my height? <laughs> You'll be using the air keys whilst holding shift will you let you rotate the camera or zoom in and out. Wow, that's a good tip. I never knew that, actually. Cool. Okay, so... Nice. We're back on the path where we should be. Fucking zoom out. Brilliant. Does he want us to zoom all the way out? Look at our island. You have completed all your objectives. Great! Now then, before we can welcome our first guests, we have to build an enclosure for them. After all, we wouldn't want one of our gigantic carnivorous reptiles roaming loose about the countryside. Now would we? It is an island though, so they would not be able to leave unless they got on that boat, which... I guess they could. Whoa, 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 whoa. Screen scroll. Once you have finished, we'll move on to the laboratory. I'm sure you will enjoy your stay. Build an enclosure and an observation area. Okay, I know how to do that very easily. Let's build one right here. We'll put a very small dinosaur in it. Very nice. Oh, there's no option for a food bowl. I guess he's going to give us the entire tutorial. Oh my gosh, I could only build two. <laughs> I would like more than that usually. The starter's out of the way. Now, onto the main course. The laboratory. It is here that we will conceive, cross, and clone our dinosaurs. If you take a look inside the cooler, you'll find it contains the egg of our very first dinosaur. It's a hypsilophodon. Hypsilophodon. A herbivorous specimen. And I believe it is just about ready to be welcomed into the world, Professor. We're about to witness this historical moment. I got it. All right, let's go. Cooler. Egg. Well, look at this lad. He's beautiful. I love him. Son. Prepare to be birthed! Whoa! Prepare to be rocketed into the ocean! I wish there was an option to fucking slow down the camera in this game, but we don't even get that. The, uh, the options are very limited. Into the container you go. Ah, I just realized there's no sound. Hold on. The soundtrack in this game bops, so I gotta fix that really quick. I've been just talking in silence for the past however long. There we go. <laughs> Love to hear it. That sounds much better. There's jungle noises and like good fucking shit. We have a dino and sound. Very good. What was that? A little ding dong. Just for me. I want to zoom in. I want you to see my boy. Look at this lad. Hey, this lad. Look at him go. Oh, we can name him. What shall we name him? Uh, little dude. Wait, what are you? Right, do- can we find out if you're, like, a? Well, you're starving. Well, how do I- I can't fix that because it didn't give me the option to feed you. I have no name and no game prompt. This is good. Oh, should I go back to the lab or something? No, I guess not. Oh! Another? Jesus. Fuck. Uh, I- um... Boop, boop, boop. Ba -da -da. Doo -doo. It's fucking music slaps, I'm telling you. Put the coelophysis in the cage! Welcome to the world, man. Can we have the next order of business, perhaps? Before they starve? Maybe we should save the game. Campaign. Uh, good. Oh, here it is. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Create a second hypsilodon. Create two coelophyses. Do not lose any dinos. I can't even feed them yet. Oh my god. Fucking clone. Clone. In the cooler. Give me the coelophyses. Put it in the coelophyses cage. In the cooler. 
Go to place in an enclosure. Great. Yay! Let's put that there. And now we can finally build paths. We need to build a farm now. Thank you very much, I know. Excellent, Professor. Now I must build a farm! I... <laughs> Losing it. I'm sure our dinos will want their feeding dishes uh, filled regularly. Note that buildings, like feeding dishes, must be connected to roads. Everything must be connected to a road in life. Once a farm has been constructed, we ought to hire staff. Of course, uh, you'd like to tour the enclosures yourself every morning, Professor. Farm it is. Farm is being built. We're watching in real time. Snoozing it up. Come on. When I was young, I would used to play in like first person like this. I'd be like, I am a I'm a construction worker. I am helping. This is the good shit right here. This is early 2000s art. Prevent the dinosaurs from starving. Obviously. <laughs> no, what the fuck? The seal of Isis killed the other seal of Isis. Oh, fucking shit. Oh my god. Oh, fucking fuck. We're gonna have to fucking clone him again. They've been known to cannibalize because he was starving. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Fix that real quick. There we go. Very nice. All right. Don't eat each other. Thank you very much. In fact, I should probably get two bowls. Fun fact, after they're done eating, they fart. Did you like that? That early 2000s humor. Ha! Ah, dinosaur fart. What's my objective? Prevent the dinosaurs from starving. They've eaten, right? Get up! Eat! Oh, fucking shit. Burr, 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 burr. Through all that, uh, we can start experimenting with crossbreeding. The laboratory enables you to create a hybrid by crossing two different dinosaurs. Select two dinosaurs from a different species, cross them, and observe the amazing results. Okay. No dinosaurs dying on my watch. Yes. Yeah, just give him food all the time. I don't care. Let's name this one Dot, because he's got some dots i guess and we'll name this other one spot dot and spot we love that for them this dinosaur uh will be snoot and this dinosaur will be boot i want to create a new enclosure for a hybrid dinosaur because i feel like it's too much dino going on you know hold on let me fix this Boop. bank 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 all right let's cross some fucking dinosaurs let's get that cross them oh boy you would be herbivorous. Interesting. All right. Put it out. Do you realize we have just created an entirely new dinosaur species? Something tells me that soon experts will have to reconsider their classification tables. But this isn't all we can do, Professor. By crossing two hybrids, we can modify the genes to create dozens of variations with potentially spectacular results. Try it out. Clone your new hybrid dinosaur, then cross the two hybrids by altering their genes. We should be able to make the next dinosaur more intelligent than any we know of so far. This should be child's play to you, Professor. Oh, trust me, it is... Boom. Banky bop. Boop. Boop. Bank. What does our hybrid look like, actually? Uh, good. Lay down. I want to look at you, but lay down. We can name him Thing. Pretty cute. Love the color. Clone. Thing and wing. Thing and wing. Chicken wing. Thing and wing. Cross. Oh my. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. This is wild! Let's do that- those, I guess. But maybe I'll do some fucked up shit to the leggies. Yeah, like, what the fuck is that? Ooh, carnivore? Alright, that's all I can fuck with. Is that it? Oh, with an intelligence rating of at least 80. I see. I see. 51! Good! Okay. Yes, the Coelophyces are very smart. Doesn't give us an option for intelligence. Hey, but that does it. Whoa! That's fucking cool, yeah! Oh no! He's losing intelligence. Oh, okay, so it has to be this one for the intelligence. But I like the way this looks! Alright, let's do that. Place and closure, put him in here, I don't care. Oh, you have succeeded, Professor! At times like this, I congratulate myself on having spent my life locked away in a laboratory. Let's not stop now. There are many more hybrids waiting to be discovered. The cooler holds a new Pelicanemimus egg. Together with this new specimen, and as we already have an infinity possibility to... Possible developments is possible. Of possible developments is possible. Possible. Of evolution, my friend, is about to take a giant leap ahead! Alright. 
What I actually need to do though? Create and then create two new hybrids vibes. Let's make like uh, another little ditty because this is gonna get out of hand pretty fast. Oops, don't need that. You are herbivores, but I think you are not, right? Yeah, you're carnivores, so that's kind of awkward. Herbivores can go with herbivores though, so let me change where you go. You can go in here. Y'all can really kind of just all go together. Doesn't really matter. Him, however, he's kind of got to be shoved in there. All right, freeing up space, freeing up space. <gasps> oh, this, I think this is my favorite dinosaur. I just love the way this one looks. And he is herbivorous. I love that. All right, I'll put him in here. We're going to need some more um, bowls. Pink, 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 pink. All the time. We need flowers all the time. Give us flowers every single second. Let's go to the lab. Let's cross him. And wing, maybe? Let's cross. Ooh. Ooh. Look at that. That's kind of cool. Kind of like the blue feeties. Let's do the blue feeties. Let's put it in here. Oh, very nice. Ah, there you are, Professor. I have a delicate problem to present to you. Oh, no. We have been reviewing our upkeep costs, and the result has shocked the government. <sighs> that damn government. Our dinos have a very healthy appetite. After lengthy and trying discussions, the ministry has authorized us to... Open our institution to the public in order to finance further research. I'm counting on you to put some effort into making our center more... Attractive. Attract 30 visitors. You got it. Listen. Can do. Not a fucking problem. Trust me. Look at this. We can just put stands out already. We get very limited things, but there we go. Let's make them feel welcome. Here's a little palm tree for you. I can actually change the game speed, so I can make it go faster. Which is usually what I like to play it on. I like to play it on. Fest! Give it up, Mori. All right, here come the people. We can have more observation towers than just this, actually. Let's really fuck it up with observation towers. You have nobody in it, so fuck you. Boop. So we got a guy. Yes, one single person we have now. You're not really giving me a whole lot of options on attracting people. Gotta be honest. But I'm doing my best. Look at him go. You are the first customer, my friend. This game is so... Oh, second customer! Oh no, we've got lots of customers now. Look, they're just coming on in. This game is like visually a lot. Since you can kind of just clip through literally everything. Give a fucking vibe though. Oh, people are fighting in here. No fighting. Do we need to have more ostrich? We need ostrich at every hour? I don't care. Overtime, baby. Actually, we probably need a couple more farms up in here. Up in here. Boop. Cool. Because that will help us uh, feed the ever-growing population of dinosaurs we have. As the guests trickle in. Maybe we can go a little faster. <laughs> there we go. Yippee! Alright. Yeah! Come on in, people! Look at my dinosaurs. Behold my dinosaurs! Behold! Two, one, yay! Burr, burr. Construct two attractions, achieve a fun rating of 30 for all visitor profiles. Have you heard the latest, Professor? It appears our visitors are bored! What the fuck? We have fucking dinosaurs! What more do you want? I've been told people are asking for more di diversions. I was gonna say dinosaurs, but they don't want more dinosaurs. They want shit to do other than the dinosaurs. That's the attraction. Look at our dinosaurs. We created like literally things we shouldn't have and, and you're just, you're bored. Great. In my day, we would have been quite content to watch a Mesozoic herbivore grazing, but you know how young people are these days? We must find a way to amuse our visitors. So let's take a triceratops by the horns, as they say. I don't know if they say that. But anyway, let's uh, let's attract the people, shall we? We can't attract them there. There we go. can make that into an extension. It needs to be above 30 for everybody. Surfer's gonna be hard to please. Yay! I guess they weren't that hard to please. <laughs> Create a show with seedings. All right, I know how to do this. Ah, Professor, our research has seen j great challenge changes. Don't you? Oh my God, I guess I can reading is over. Time, reading's done. Shutting down. 
Only a short while ago, I was spending days on and excavating old bones. And today, I'm being asked to come up with original shows to make our dinosaurs more appealing. I'm really getting too old for this kind of thing, you know. I think it's about time I thought about retiring. And I'm afraid I must appeal to you again to keep our visitors happy. They say they want to see the dinos in action. Well, give them what they want. Aye, aye, Captain. Hold on. The time passing by so quick is stressing me out. Alright, let's build our show over here. And I'll build it from scratch just because it's fun that way. And content. Uh, beautiful. It's just going to be a wee little a wee little thing. I guess this is enough to fit a couple people. Let's see how many of these we can get in here. This way everybody can have a place to be. Why aren't you giving me anything? That's kind of rude. Why can't I put it this in between? That's also very rude. I don't want it anywhere else. All right, small seating. Boop. Boop. Not enough money. Oh no, I'm just spending like fucking crazy over here. I gotta wait. How much does it cost? Oh, 500? Whoa. You see those people just pop off this uh, fucking spinny doodad? That's a little dangerous. Not wearing their seatbelts or something? Uh, we're almost there. Please spend more money. Ah, we dipped under. We hit it, but then we dipped. What did we spend? What are we spending money on? Food? It was at the top of the hour? Oh my god, look at these people. They're dancing. Why don't we have more money then? If everybody's so happy. Fuck. I can't make them any happier. I have nothing to do that with. Please, just get me money. Ah, oh, ah, ah, go. Bah. Eh. All right, now we officially have no money. No obstacles or anything, just race? All right. Uh, incorrect. That is not actually what I wanted to do, I'm sorry. Forgot how this game works for a second. Because I want them to have a reward, of course. I will do two herbivorous hybrids, and perhaps if I have them to... Fuck you. Can't I move that thing? Damn it! Got rid of my ship! Why is everything hard in this game? It should be simple. It's really such a simple game. Unbelievable. So unfortunate. Oh, you know what I can do? <laughs> Watch this. Bam! Revolutionary. Genius! And the boot. We need more seating than just that. We need surround seating. Not enough money! Oh, I forgot. I forgot. Oh, oh, maybe I should undo. Ah! Why? No! I mean, yes, that one, but not the whole thing. Why did you do that? Who? What? Ah! Gah! I forgot to set fucking food for him! Ah, he was cool! Ah, ah, uh, people aren't gonna like that. Uh, my bad on that dinosaur, though. I never usually try to have that happen, but sometimes, you know, so shit happens, okay? Anyway, uh, let's see. Got to make some more freaking dinosaurs. Ooh, alright. Let's, uh, let's do that. Let's cross some, let's cross some dinosaurs. Stamina? Yeah. Let's fuck around with that, actually, because I want that to be higher. Whoa, not that low. Okay, there we go. Not enough money, oh no, that costs a lot of fucking money. Alright, I forgot we can just hurry this shit up. Yep, that's the way to play the game. Back to what I was doing. Cross him. Oh my god, with the money. It's $3,000, I know. Alright, fine. In the meantime, I'll spend money. <laughs> hey, uh, alright. Satisfy at least one profile with your show. Whoa. Uh, worth every cent in my opinion, Professor. Let's just hope that visitors enjoy the show. As you have performed so brilliantly up to now, I'll leave the choice of which dinos will take part down to you. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll all give their best shot. In any case, a little exercise never hurt anybody. Let's wait for this money to recharge. Please spend more money. I need a dinosaur. I guess I don't need one. I just wanted to make some cool hybrids to race each other, but... Thang. Wang. Yeah, you're an herb. You're a little herby. That's what your name will be, herb. Oh, Wang is herbivorous? Oh, Thing is also herbivorous. What the fuck is happening? Am I going wild? It's too late in the night for this. Uh, loot. Since you're in here with Boot and Snoot. Alright, let's do Snoot. 
a regular old Coelophysis. We'll do loot, because he's a hybrid. And then we'll do... Thing. A hybrid. And we'll do Spot. A regular dude. Very curious to see who wins this. Let's have a show, shall we? What time is it now? Let's make it uh, for this time and open it up to the public. But I'll slow down time when we get to it because I want to actually see what this race is about. Stop! Let's go a little bit. Let's go a little bit down, right? I want to see it. I want to take it in. There we go. Very quick. I love how they go for each other's food. Who won? Oh, the herbivores win! I should have made multiple rounds. I feel like that would have been fun, but... Oh, people didn't enjoy it? People didn't enjoy it? Alright, stop blinking. What do people think? Most satisfied are the scientists. Of course, of course. Well, they should be. But how do I see, like, who really likes it? There we go. Satisfy at least one profile with your show? Uh, didn't I do that? The, uh, fucking... Scientists? Are they not satisfied? Well, let's just boot this back up and we'll wait like a whole day. And in fact, I'll probably change the show calendar and make this tomorrow at 10 because... There. We'll make it three rounds this time. Three rounds this time! Not Kansas time! Hey, everybody get in here! Get in! Back down. Alright, Ari goes quick enough. Oh, I hate it when they hop around like that. What the? Green again? Red that time. This is different each time. Carnivores are having a bad time. Yellow! Yeah, now the carnivores are winning. Alright. Well, herbivores won. Yay! We won! Congratulations, Professor! Thanks to your expert management, Project Dinos has proved a great success. Now nothing can stop the golden age of genetic research on dinosaurs. The story of the dinos is only just beginning. Ooh. Oh, it for- Whoa! I was not expecting the cinematic after that. <laughs> there are, in fact, uh, several cinem cinematic things like that. Uh, I guess one after each of these. So we have a little uh, something to look forward to as we work through this campaign. Um, the next one is going to be Dino Ethics. That's uh, pretty cool. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. That was, in fact, Dino Island campaign number one. Tune in uh, next time for the rest of these campaigns. Tune in next time for Dino Ethics. Uh, we'll see what Dino Ethics are next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Stereotypical like and subscribe kind of uh, exit outro here. Um, if you enjoy my stuff, I really appreciate the support. Thank you very much. And have a great day.